when Rova says, we're at the vets. Mama brought me to the vets to get my checkup and have the vets look at me and say hello and meet me. Huh. Yes, my pretty girl. She likes it down on the floorboard. That's where she tends to go every time. Huh. We're waiting out here because she's young and new, so we don't want to have her contaminated with any other germs that might be in the vet. So we're going in the back into the isolation room. She says, I'm at the vets. Hi, how good, how are you? Hi, you are pretty dog. you're cute. Oh my gosh, you're so soft. She is, she's a sweetheart. Yeah, she looks like it. Hi, you're so good. You're Hi. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so I was talking to Courtney. She said that she's, is she having issues with peeing or tummy? She's peeing a lot. Okay. A lot, but she will go all night and not pee. So okay. when she's in her crate, she does not pee. But I've noticed, um, like she'll pee like every thirty minutes to an hour, and sometimes it's just little bitty dots, and sometimes it looks like she's peeing, but there's nothing there. It's not common for uh, puppies to have like UTIs and that mm -hmm. kind of stuff. Although certainly I think it's possible. She Maybe doesn't seem like she's in any pain or anything. And like I said, when she's in the crate, she does not go. But when she's running around the house, she'll just like go. Mm -hmm. You know? And I'm not used to him going as often so, as she goes. I wonder if it's a puppy thing that we're just not used to. Mm -hmm. My thought is there's a few things that we could do. One is I could uh, put the ultrasound on her tummy. Um, it's, we don't, you know, we don't charge anything just to look at their bladder with mm -hmm. it and just see if it looks like there's inflammation. In okay. There. If she's got inflammation in her bladder, it means that she might have a UTI. Okay. Um, so that would be one thing. It's not invasive. It's mm -hmm. Yeah, that's fine. And we could try that and just see if it looks abnormal. Mm -hmm. and then that might tell us. Okay. Um, and then the other option would be to, you know, um, catch some urine and yeah. run a urinalysis. I stuff. haven't, yeah, I haven't had her go potty yet. Whatever you want to do, you um, tell if me. If you want to work it up. That's the way to do it. Okay. If you think it might be normal puppy behavior, then we could, you know, wait a little while. And okay. See. And maybe what we could do today is split the difference. Maybe we could just take her back, let her bladder, make sure it looks normal. If it looks normal, maybe we can give her some time to see. Okay. And see if it's normal. Puppy okay. Give me one second. I'm going to run back and make sure there's nobody in our radiology room. Okay. And then we'll run back there and uh, take a look at her bladder. Thank okay. you. Right. She says this is full. <laughs> oh, you like them, huh? Oh, look at my sweet baby. She says, I like them, Mama. They're very nice. She weighs 22.8 ounces. 22 pounds and 8 ounces. Huh. She says, I'm a big girl. Oh, come here. Hold on. You like your new vet? Mm -hmm. She says, oh, they're really nice, Mama. They're really nice. She's so big. I was like 20 pounds. She's only three months old. She's too big. <laughs> you might not make it to the back. I know. <laughs> okay. You just have her stand on the table for you. We don't have to roll it over or anything. Okay, Mom, so this is the extra. Thank you. Just turn your head that way. Can you see that? And uh, what we'll do is we'll just put a little spot of alcohol in her tummy. Okay. And, uh, <laughs> okay, I'll tell you, if she wants to lay down, that's fine. Okay. What we'll do is I'll just put a little spot right here. All right. Good girl. Okay. And then this is where we're looking for the um, ultrasound. Okay. So, let's see if we can find a little book. There we are. Okay, so that's her bladder, that big black spot. That's so cool. Okay, sweetie, you're fine. Okay. Okay. To me, it looks like the bladder wall is normal. It doesn't look like there's any inflammation there. Okay. I don't see any normalization, and I don't see anything floating. Okay. So my thought is... Just normal? Just okay. okay. Yeah, I figured maybe just from being loose in the house now, you yeah. know, running around. Yeah. So she's like, oh, I think I gotta pee. Yeah. I, I think because, you know, people. So when I saw her like traveling while she was trying to pee and not peeing, I was like, hmm, 
She thinks uh, she's got to pee. <laughs> we can, um, if you want, we can catch some urine and do your analysis if you'd like to. Um, my thought is she doesn't have any inflammation there. I don't see any medical Yeah, I don't. Yeah, there's anything. no need to do that. It's likely that it's just a puppy issue. Yeah. But I don't want you to think I'm, blo- I'm blowing you off or anything. I don't think. Are you kidding me? Yeah. No. Yeah. Listen, yeah. I am yeah. so yeah. happy with you right now. <laughs> Listen, guys, you guys need to check out Tavares Animal Hospital if you were looking <laughs> for a vet, okay? I, you guys, back when Richard and Celia were here, yeah. they were my vets for the past, um, I'm not going to say, it's been over 20 years, I'll say that. Tonka. I'm oh, so I excited. I think cool you saw yeah, Legend. Okay. I'm pretty so. sure that you yeah. saw Legend. Um, yeah. About six years ago, I think it's been about. Oh, mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, man. She always has the nice yeah. <laughs> It's so good to see you It's good again. to see you, too. Alright, so we're just checking left nose right now. The ones behind the knees are called popliteal. Mm-hmm. So we're checking this eye. So we we'll check the other one, and then we're gonna check our angle of nodes. Now look at your bottom, okay? Good. Okay, it looks good. We're gonna feel your tummy. Yeah, big girl. I know it. Mm-hmm. Good. Everything feels normal in there. I don't feel any issues as far as our umbilicus goes, which is good. Okay. <laughs> she likes she's she's broken husky. She likes to lay down. <laughs> she's a little lazy. Such a good girl, Monroe. Yeah, she is so good. You are such a good girl. Okay, good. Okay, you see your eyes? They're pretty blue eyes. Yeah. Good. Okay, I'm gonna turn this off for a sec, okay? Chompers. Oh, yes, she does. Oh, yes. Yeah, uh-huh. sharp little puppy yeah, chompers. And, lose them all by yes. six months old. Yep. And if you could trim her talons, yeah. I would so appreciate it. She is... <laughs> she got my chin the other day. Oh, I was like, she? oh, my word. She does have some talons on her. Okay, so let's talk about her vaccinations. Okay. Um, is she all up to date or what's She's going on? She's up to date. When I got her, She um, it said that she needed to have her... Um, Rabi- her second rabies booster, I think. Uh, we don't typically booster rabies. I didn't think either. so. I wasn't sure. I'm um, here. Hold on a second. And I. What we do with puppies is we try to get two negative fecal samples. Mm-hmm. So if you've already had one negative, um, then we'll do one more okay. fecal sample. And then once you've had two negatives, then we'll recheck her in a year. Okay. Um, if she's had a rabies vaccine, that's typically good for a year. We don't booster rabies. Okay. Um, we typically in Florida give it after 14 weeks. Um, in Alabama, we used to give it after 12, you know, uh-huh. but anyways, um, so as long as it, you've had one after 14 weeks, that's good for rabies. Okay. Um, December Parva, we try to give them at least two vaccinations after 12 weeks. So, okay. um, my thought would be that you definitely want to make sure that a veterinarian has given her two vaccinations after 12 weeks. Okay. Well, you, um, you'll do that. Yeah. So we can do that. Um, we'll do a fecal on her. It sounds like she's already had her rabies. Did they give you a rabies certificate? I do have a health certificate. 
It might um, be on there. I forgot the paperwork at home. I was sneaking her out so Tonka didn't know, so I yeah. put her out the window. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I didn't want Tonka to know she was coming with me. And so then I walked out and said, hi, Tonka, mom's going to be back. So he would know that I was free without her. I, I made him think she was in her crate. <laughs> well, so. So I do have, but I don't, I didn't see anything about that. Just on that paperwork that I just read you. Um, you if your, your uh, paperwork. I'll check the paperwork, okay. but if, if you think that she does, I mean, you can call the vet. Yeah. I know that they said they were going to, yeah. Yeah, okay, let me and call you them can, real quick and just have them fax me the vaccine information. Okay. And then, or I'll just get a phone. Yeah, then, because they said that the, the breeder um, gave her the first two of the other ones. Yeah, it depends on when he gave them. Mm -hmm. You know, so if, there, if it was before 12 weeks. Yeah, because she's the, just the, now 13 weeks. Yeah, so my thought would be you should probably. Do it after? Okay. Yeah, you should probably give her one December now, wait okay. four weeks and give her another one. Okay. Okay, and then um, we'll have to check on our babies. Okay. Give me just one minute, all right? Okay, thank you. You're welcome. What a good girl you are. Look at you. She says, oh, I have a big bear. Look, she looks like a bear rug. <laughs> You're all sprawled out like a bear rug. What's up with that? With the pretty blue eyes. <laughs> she's a lazy husky. <laughs> when she's not tearing the house apart. Uh, her name is going to be Legends Hurricane Monroe. <laughs> because she is a little hurricane. She's so cute. Thank you. They gave it kind of earlier than we typically do here. So what we're going to do today is we're going to give a December part of a vaccination. Okay. Uh, we're due for that. In three weeks, I'm going to have you come back and do a December parvo and a rabies. Okay. Um, and then... That's it. Okay. And I'll also have you recheck the fecal because you just had one not too long ago. I brought poop yeah. in with you. Oh, mm -hmm. Okay, so we'll, I brought we'll, two we'll in. send that one in then. Okay. I brought two. Uh, we'll stick them together and send them uh, The lab will run before us. Well, so. I noticed, and is it normal that, um, like, the beginning of her poo is hard, mm -hmm. and then it kind of gets soft because she goes a lot. Yeah. And then at the end, it's kind of like jelly-like. In, in puppies, it can be. And, oh. It depends on how much activity they've been doing and stuff. Too. Okay. I mean, if they're running around like crazy, yes. sometimes they'll have a good stool, and then they'll have a lesser stool. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they might have a little bit of, you know, um, like you said. Yeah. Okay. So that's normal. Yeah. Um, I am feeding her. They had her on four health grain free. Mm -hmm. I'm feeding her backcountry's Merrick raw infused okay. grain free. Okay. Go ahead and grab the okay. Like I said, we do one now, one um, to three weeks or four weeks, depending on what your schedule is like. And then oh, my schedule is open. Okay. So three or four weeks is fine. Then. Okay. And then, um, at that time, we'll do the rabies, and that'll be it. And, and your name? I don't think we get your... This is Josh, yeah, guys. I, <laughs> you, I'm loving you. Now, when I come in here, can I make sure that you're the one taking care of the dogs? Yes. So I just have to request you when yeah. I make the appointment? Okay. Yeah. All of our doctors here are awesome, though. I'm yeah. sure they are, but yeah. I kind of like to stick with, you know... <laughs> yeah, that's fine. That's when fine. Richard and Celia left, I was like, oh, my gosh. Yeah. No, we have really a good group of doctors here. Um, Dr. Blackwell's here now. My wife Stephanie works here now. Yeah. Um, but, I mean, we have a really good group. We That's have a great so staff. cool. I think you'll really enjoy everybody here. So. That's so cool. I still just want to see you though. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> it's okay. I think it's easier too though if you if you see him every time, then you yeah. know everything. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So. I'm 100 percent okay with yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah, cool. I get that. Um, I just don't want you to be nervous about seeing anybody else. I'm not. Yeah, I'm not. That's just my personality. It's like if I like you, you're you're who I want to see. I, and you know what? I would probably eventually be good with seeing your wife too because I did see Richard and Celia. Celia did the surgeries on my dogs and. I loved her because she let me watch. So I would come in and I saw my dogs at Spain. Did you? How are they doing? That's so cool. They just got back from a mission trip. They went to Arizona. I think is where they were. That's so cool. They went to a was an Navajo reservation. Oh my gosh! And they did all kinds of stuff, mostly surgery, but a lot of other stuff as well. That's so cool. Okay, left shoulder. So let's turn the other way. And so we give all our vaccinations in certain places. So okay. Maybe know if there's any issues like lumps or bumps. Or oh, injuries, okay. That um, that we'll know kind of what causes it. So gotcha. Go right here, and that's it. Good job, baby. Good. He's so Pretty tough. Good. He's right. so tough. Uh, let's see as far as that goes. Okay, so I gotta get running. Okay, thank you so much. You're I appreciate your welcome. time. You're very welcome. You'll have a great day. Okay, we'll see you in three, four weeks. Okay. So. And, um, well, you'll probably see you before that because I need to bring Tonka in. So. Also, we'll call you if there's anything on the fecal. The 
That's the type okay. of thing that we don't call yet. Okay. okay. All right. Thank you. Yeah. She looks really healthy. And you find any abnormalities as far as you know anything to worry about. So, um, did you have any other questions or anything? Um, no, I think you answered all of them, and I really appreciate it. You're welcome. Did we get a random yes. answer? Okay, well, that was a successful trip. Monroe likes her new doctor, and so do I. Huh, I'm going to bring Tonka back tomorrow for his shots. She did super good. I'm so proud of her. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Uh, Monroe's going to say, see you later, alligators. And I'm going to say, you guys be super blessed. Oh, and after a while, crocodiles. Later.